hi everyone welcome back to my channel it's been a while so let's get started so I'm going to be showing you guys how I do my hair I start off using the Garnier products I use their shampoo and conditioner their anti frizz and the flat iron protector and they are from the sleek and shine collection I use a wide tooth comb when I have the conditioner in my hair and that helps take the tangles out so if you guys have an issue with untangling your hair, the best way to do it is while you have conditioner in your hair and you use the comb and you all good then. So I don't have any tangles since I already did that and I'm going to be using the anti-frizz serum from Garnier. I only use a small amount, not even a full pump and I will disperse this all through my hair all the way to the ends. This product is very lightweight, so you don't have to worry about it weighing your hair down. Now I'm going to be using my blow dryer, and I have a thermal blow dryer comb, and this also helps with getting my hair really straight. Please do not mind the tissue that is on um, in between the hair comb and the blow dryer. This blow dryer comb comes off really easy. You have to tighten it really, really, really tight. And I broke the little attachment that goes in between there. So I have to stick tissue or cardboard uh, in there to keep it all really tight. So, yeah. So I blow dry my hair going around my nape, my edges, all around there first. I do not have to section my hair in any particular sections because my hair is very trained. So I've been doing this method for a long time. So there's no sectioning for me. But if you have, like, really coarse hair and can't control it, then I would suggest you section it. Right here, I kind of break my hair into half so I could get all through the middle and the top. I love this blow dryer um, comb. It helps so much get my hair straight. And it only takes me like five minutes or less to blow dry my hair. So while I'm blow drying the front of my hair, I kind of get my hair going into the direction um, of where I wear my part. It's like my part is like pretty much permanent. So I don't even really have to part my hair right there. And now I just push the cool shock button to make sure that my scalp is nice and dry without me having to burn it up with the blow dryer. So I just go around all of my hair, my edges, my scalp to make sure everything is all nice and dry. Alright, so I had to take a little pause. My kids came home from school, so I had to fix dinner and whatnot. So now I'm getting ready to section my hair into three so I can get ready to straighten it. I have been having this part forever. I wear it to the side like that. Section this side off. I'm going to just put the clip on there. Section this front. And I'll place a clip right there, twisting it up to the top so I can keep this hair out of my face. I will also be sectioning this other side up. This is helping me keep in control of my hair while I do the back and all this hair is not in my way. Now I'm going to be using the Flat Iron Protector by Garnier Fertis and just spraying that all over my hair in the back because I don't want to section, uh, spray it like every single section. So I'm going to take uh, like about maybe an inch or less and start from the nape area and working my way on up. I love this Numi flat iron. This I don't think they still have this one. This was from the Vintage Collection. And they also have a sale every year for Black Friday. So you guys look out for that. Their sales is 70% um, on the whole site. So you guys keep an eye out on that. Because I love their flat irons. And I plan on getting me a new one. Because I have dropped this one so much. And I chipped the plates. So right now I'm just going to keep working my way on up. Not making too big of a sections. I think all of my hair is like pretty much have permanent parts because I've been doing my hair the same way like forever. I don't even have to put too much effort into using to straighten my hair with this. I used to press my hair and flat iron it when I used to use my hair stove and now I only just have to use this flat iron and that's it. You see how straight it's getting? It's the ball. 
Now I'm working my way. This is on my left side. This side usually takes no time. Of course, you see how small this is. Just splaying that flat iron protector again. I'm going to be working my way up on, up on that side as well. Now ready to do this last section, spraying the spray all over again. And I always tap right by the root area first before I pull it down, just like maybe two or three taps with the flat iron. And it gets like really close to your edges. You don't have, even have to worry about burning yourself. I don't know why my hair has always been short right there in that front part. And it doesn't help that I color it too, but oh well, it's all good. Oh, my gray hairs. So now I'm bumping my ends. I call this my little mommy on the go hairstyle because I'm always busy with the kids and I could just wrap my hair up just doing my hair like this and it's just very easy for me because I don't like just wearing a ponytail all the time and looking frumpy so this is hairstyle is just really easy an easy off and go hairstyle just unwrap your hair in the morning comb it and you're good to go I'm just gonna bump these last two sections in the front Sometimes I wear my hair curly, but for this video, I'm just going to bump these ends. So after my hair has cooled down some, I'm just combing it out before I get ready to wrap it just like playing with it and feeling it for a little bit I just love the way my hair feels after I wash it I hate this whole process I cannot stand washing my hair but I love the way it feels to have clean hair so now I'm going to spray my Vante Silk Radiant spray all over my hair after I wrap it my hair already feels nice and silky and already has a slight shine to it but this is going to make it feel even silkier and I have a lot more shine so I start off by combing the front side my right side towards the back then I take this section right here and I'm gonna comb this right on over some people use a comb some people use a brush but either way is fine for me I just had the comb handy right here so I'm taking another piece from the back and then just keep taking sections and then combing it around I try to be very neat with this because I don't like um, to have like any dents in my hair I want my hair to be like as straight as possible so I'm always like really neat about this part now I'm going to spray this all over. This is going to help lay these edges and my hair and flyaways and everything down even more. I don't know if you can already see the shine, but it is shining. Now I'm going to be using some plastic wrap and wrapping my hair with this. This is going to seal in all the moisture. It's going to make my hair even more shinier and silkier than it already is. It's going to help all those flyaways stay down. I find using this method, it even helps make my hair last a whole lot longer. I usually keep my hair um, straight for, or, or if I curl it for about two weeks before I wash my hair. So this method has helped out a whole lot 
after I do my hair like this, I hardly ever even have to even get my flat iron unless I have worked out or something and sweated the um, middle of my hair out. So after I place that, I'm going to go around in case any hair is not straight like it was, like right here in the front. So I want to just smooth that down. And plus, I sweat a lot, so I don't want my edges to be sweating. So I'm just trying to make sure all of that is in there. I'm just twisting and making sure that it stays in that wrap. Now I'm getting ready to use my Golden Hot Hooded Hair Dryer. This is a soft cap. I used to have the hard, the big hood, but I left it behind when I moved one time. So I'm going to keep this on for 15 minutes. I'm going to have it on low and on cool because I do not want to sweat out all of this hard work that I have just done. That would just be pointless. So, it's about to be 15 minutes. Yay. Getting ready to take this cap off. All the air is going down. Slowly take the cap off. And just a few hairs out right there are out of place, but that's all good. So, I'm going to twist this off. And get ready to comb all this out. I love this spray, y'all. Bonte, that silk radiance is the bomb. I have been using that for over probably 15 years now. So I'm just going to comb my hair out. It feels so silky, you guys. Just getting my little part together. I cannot stand those gray hairs are right there, right in my part. Yes, it is nice and silky and bouncy. Of course, I'm feeling myself. Hey. With my hair being that other color, you can't tell how shiny it is on this camera, but it is so shiny, guys. Here's the back. So this is all just straightening from the flat iron. No relaxer here. I get questioned that a lot if I have a relaxer. So I'm going to either use my Vante wax or the silk effects for my edges. Not today because I'm just going to wrap my hair right back on up. But that is it you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see y'all later.